Delage starts producing two-seater D12 hypercar with up to 1,100 HP. Delage expects it to take four to five years to produce all 30 examples of the D12 hybrid hypercar. Delage has begun production of the D12 hypercar, producing four examples of the 30 vehicles it currently plans. The D12 was first unveiled in 2020 by the revived Delage brand and is produced at a factory in Magne Cours, France. Laurent Tappy, the man behind the next generation Delage brand, says it will take four to five years for the company to complete production of the D12 hypercar and admits that it takes time for the brand to become known. The car attracts a lot of attention because there's nothing else out there like it, he told Autocar. The brand has been dormant for 70 years, so it's not going to be an overnight success. Delage starts producing two-seater D12 hypercar with up to 1,100 HP. Driving the Delage D12 is a 7.6-liter naturally aspirated V12 mated to an 8-speed automatic transmission and backed by an electric motor. Two models are offered, the standard GT, with a total output of 1,100 horsepower, and the lightweight club, which has a smaller electric motor, is limited to 1,010 horsepower, and is 198 pounds, 89.8 kilograms, lighter than the GT. The carbon fiber monocoque structure that forms the basis of the D12 is very similar to the Chinger 21C and jet fighters, with the driver sitting in the middle and the passenger positioned directly behind them. This enabled the Delage team to design an incredibly slim cockpit, making the car as aerodynamically efficient as possible. One particularly interesting element of the D12 is its use of the contraction suspension system used by McLaren and Ferrari in Formula One in the 1990s and invented by Delage's current chassis and suspension chief, Mauro Bianchi. It's not yet known whether Delage will sell all 30 units of the D12, but with an average starting price of $2 million, we know it's not cheap. Delage isn't resting on its laurels with D12. Tappy told Autocar that the company is already planning its second production car, which will be a fast grand touring car similar to the Bugatti Chiron. He even added that it will have a hybrid powertrain and that design work has begun on the company's third model.